Margaret Higgins Sanger, born Margaret Louise Higgins, September 14, 1879, September 6, 1966, also known as Margaret Sangers Lee, was an American birth control activist, sex educator, writer, and nurse. Sanger popularized the term birth control, opened the first birth control clinic in the United States, and established organizations that evolved into the Planned Parenthood Federation of America. Sanger used her writings and speeches primarily to promote her way of thinking. She was prosecuted for her book Family Limitation under the Comstock Act in 1914. She was afraid of what would happen, so she fled to Britain until she knew it was safe to return to the U.S. Sanger's efforts contributed to several judicial cases that helped legalize contraception in the United States. Due to her connection with Planned Parenthood, Sanger is a frequent target of criticism by opponents of abortion. Sanger, who has been criticized for supporting negative eugenics, remains a recognizable figure in the American reproductive rights movement. In 1916, Sanger opened the first birth control clinic in the United States, which led to her arrest for distributing information on contraception. Her subsequent trial and appeal generated controversy. Sanger felt that in order for women to have a more equal footing in society and to lead healthier lives, they needed to be able to determine when to bear children. She also wanted to prevent unsafe abortions, so-called back alley abortions, which were common at the time because abortions were usually illegal. She believed that while abortion was sometimes justified, it should generally be avoided and she considered contraception the only practical way to avoid the use of abortion.